happened? I just got banged up at practice. Um, I had some plate in there. Kind of rebuilt like RoboCop, so uh, <laughs> sometimes you got to go in and fix a little bit. It was minor, though. I've had much worse. Um, the good news is the plan is to play 16-plus games, and that's, that's going to happen. So it really wasn't a broken bone, per se? You just no, it was reported a lot worse than um, it, it is. And it looks a lot worse than it is. As you can see, I'm running around and lifting weights. I just kind of got to overprotect it. I'll give credit to the staff here, the training staff. They they won't let me do anything. You know, I'm kind of hard-headed sometimes, so I want to do more. But they've been uh, holding me back, which is good. They got the, my best interest at heart. So you think full go training camp? Uh, I don't think. I know. Okay. Yeah. I don't know if I should be talking about anything, but uh, the plan is to be back for that. Uh, and uh, we're right on schedule for that. And because of Josh Gordon's unclear future, as a teammate, what do you do to try to kind of keep his head up and, and keep him focused on football and not let this become a distraction for him? Or I, just, I just do the same thing that um, I was doing before, you know, that I guess uh, news came out. You know, it's just help motivate, you know, him and other guys. You know, I'm here as a guy that can, one, show young guys how to be professional athletes on and off the field, and, and two, uh, try to motivate them in different ways. And he's so gifted and so talented uh, that it's hard to coach greatness. It's hard to motivate greatness. Uh, and, you know, I'm not saying he's great, but he has the talent to do that. And the only reason I'm saying that is because I, I played with Randy Moss and I played with Calvin Johnson and seen these guys firsthand every day. So, uh, you know, what I, I want to try to get him to understand is if he kind of harnessed what he has and what he's been gifted with, it's going to be trouble in this league for a long time. Do you see this as an opportunity for you to do that, knowing that you spent that time, uh, you know, with a Randy, with a Calvin? I mean, you've got really, I think, the knowledge and wisdom that yeah. it takes to help him. It's, it's all about paying it forward in this league. You know, I've, I've been blessed enough to, to last 12 years, and a lot of that is because, one, I listened to the older guys when I first got in the league, and two is uh, I'm not afraid to, to give that knowledge and, and help motivate young guys uh, to a point where they're competing for my job. You know, competition for every team is great. So if I can help Josh along with the cast of receivers that we already have, at the end of the day, the first game of the season, you're going to have the best crop of receivers this team can offer. And if we do that, we're going to be uh, hard to handle. Wouldn't, you wouldn't get it the, be a uh, shame that he's remorseful for what uh, what's happened here? I don't know the details, so I couldn't really answer that. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's a, a better question, question uh, to ask him or even ask him after all this is settled. When you're uh, working with someone like with Calvin and Randy, and, and I know you can see by now that, that Josh is right up there with those guys, uh, wouldn't it be just a horrible shame for him to, to be out of the game of football for, for any type of time? Yeah, yeah. You know, that type of talent you want on the field, whether it's at practice or game day. Uh, you only get so many guys every few years that can redefine the position. Mm -hmm. And uh, he's one of those guys. You know, he's, he's not your traditional receiver. You know, neither is Calvin, neither is Randy. These guys... Uh, were hit with that special stick that God blessed him with attributes that you can only create in video games. So um, for him to miss any time, you know, it's it's a loss for everybody in general, you know, fans especially. So um, the hope is that he is on the field. Do you think Josh young, realizes that? Do you do you think he realizes that how special he can be, or is he still young and has to learn that? I think he, he understands how good he is. I mean, he's working hard. Uh, I've, I've heard things about his work ethic, but uh, from what I see, you know, he's playing at a high level. You, know, you don't need to overcoach him. You don't need to push him. When he steps on his field, he straps up and goes to work. Um, I think for some people, he makes it look easy at times, and that can be misunderstood.